मैंने इतना बुरा बोल दिया इस लिपस्टिक के लिए लेकिन इट्स इन माई टॉप फाइव इट्स अनबिलीवेबल बिकॉज इट्स ओनली फॉर द कलर मतलब तुम्हें तीन हजार खर्च करके ऐसी लिपस्टिक चाहिए जो तुम पे दिखे ही ना आई एम लविंग इट सब्सक्राइब कर दो प्लीज हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल हैप्पी न्यू ईयर दिस इज द फर्स्ट वीडियो दैट गोज लाइव इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री एंड दिस इज सॉर्ट ऑफ माई प्रोमिस इज वेल टू बी कंसिस्टेंट एंड कम हेयर विद अ लॉन्ग फॉर्मैट वीडियो एवरी वीक एट लीस्ट वंस सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड आई गेस सो मनी ऑफ यू इन यूट्यूब कॉमेंट्स और इवन ऑन इंस्टाग्राम की पास की मी अबाउट माई लिपस्टिक शेड्स सो आई थॉट आई जस्ट मेक अ वीडियो ऑन माई टॉप टेन लिपस्टिक शेड्स ऑन दैट नोट लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड देर ऑल्सो बी बोनस लिपस्टिक्स इन दी एंड because it couldn't fit in the category and i really wanted to show it to you so yep i'll be showing that to you in an order and um, let's get started so the first lipstick that i'll show you is the 10th in the ranking now i'm thinking let's go on the top se bottom side so starting with the best lipstick i have not loved a lipstick more thanks to diet sabe actually i got to know about this lipstick from there only a lot of you might know about this but um This particular lipstick got really famous after Alia Bhatt's wedding. It's none other than Pillow Talk by Charlotte Tilbury. It is so good. The packaging itself is so luxurious and uh, in general I love the lipstick. I have never found a more perfect pink nude shade lipstick. It's like nothing when you apply it. Especially in the start when I just got it, I I felt like you know is it a mistake but it's actually the best lipstick its texture is super creamy i'm not even kidding it's super creamy glides perfectly on your lips this is how it looks you know with this one you always feel like lips are moisturized you don't really need a lip balm in the start or a lip moisturizer or something like that so that you know your lips don't become dry this always keeps you moisturized and um, like i said the formulation is amazing the color is amazing so this one also has like three shades light medium and dark and mine is light and it works really well for my um, skin tone as well but i've seen people you go for like the medium shade because that comes out better on indian skin tones for me i feel like the light one worked well because i wanted a very very nude color in the sense that i wanted something like something that shows but also something that almost doesn't show so if that makes sense matlab tumhe 3000 kharch karke aisi lipstick chahiye jo tum pe dikhe hi na to aisi hogi you should have it it's worth the hype it's all worth the hype go ahead and just grab it and buy it if it comes to you on sale go ahead go ahead go ahead definitely buy it so the last lipstick was a more nude pink lipstick and this one is completely on the brown side and that's what i love about it this was the first time i tried brown shades on myself and i fell in love with it this is what made me want to have like more brown shades in my collection and if you guys also have any suggestions for brown lipsticks then definitely definitely comment down below because i would love to try out them so yeah this is the lipstick it's the mac matte top lipstick i don't know if i'm pronouncing it right but that's what it is called it's in the shade 09 So this is my little observation that whenever you go like buy affordable lipsticks like at least these bullet ones um they're not very creamy but then as and when you try like really good brands and expensive ones as well the texture the formulation is so good to your lips it's moisturizing it doesn't dry out your lips and that's one thing that you should be really looking forward to obviously there are affordable ones also which give like creamy ones but still like a lipstick version of it not many affordable brands give like a good creamy lipstick I don't want to be that person who like rubs your lipstick on the lips. I say, "The source se lagao." Mujhe nahi karna hai sab. Am I speaking too much? Okay, now, coffee nude nude lipstick game khel liya. It's time for a red. I have exactly three reds in my entire top ten category collection, and um, all three of them have a little different shade of a red. This among the three is the best red lipstick that I like, and it's the L'Oreal Paris in the shade two sixty six pure rouge. and uh, yeah it is a dream i am not scared of applying this lipstick because it looks beautiful see it's so pigmented so even though this looks super bright it has a very crimson undertone to it if you've seen any picture of me in the last year where i've used red lipstick it's this one it's my go to red lipstick and i love 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 the shade it is such an attractive red it is very beautiful for your dates it's also very beautiful for an event and um, you will be the store shield you will be the show stealer it instantly gives me that power 
um i feel like i'm not boss lady in this and uh, yeah i can never love a red lipstick enough this is your sign if you're someone who is afraid of red lipsticks definitely go out and give this a try try it maybe you will overcome your fears and 2023 is all about overcoming our fears and being more confident so definitely definitely go and try a red lipstick why that accent i don't know so in case you're like you know trying it out only to light lagao thoda pigment lagao and then haath se khali se spread kar do it will be enough but if you are very confident about the red lipstick then go ahead and apply it properly this is the fourth lipstick after the red we again have a nude lipstick this is a sugar lipstick by the way it's in the shade 10 the peach mode it's a matte attack transfer proof lipstick i don't know if it's transfer proof or not we'll see that I really like the shade. This is something that I've not tried since a long time, and I recently purchased this. And um, I love it, but there's one con to it that I hate, that I absolutely hate, is that it dries your lips. Like you'll actually feel like ये कोई drought हो गया है. मतलब बताएँ जो राजस्थान में ऐसे दिखाते हैं pictures के सूखी ज़मीन है, drought आ गया है, पपड़ी पपड़ी निकलने लग गई है. बस वैसा ही लगता है literally after applying this thing. Right now, I've applied. I mean, I used oil, na, before this lipstick, or I'm used like a balm or like a moisturizer, so it's good. Otherwise, if you directly apply it without any like lip balm, it'll be so dry. Only reason I might not repurchase it and will find like a different shade of it is because of the kind of things that it does to your lips. If only it was like hydrating, this would have been like a really good lipstick, and I would have tried more like shades of. this particular lipstick i mean it's the fourth lipstick in my collection because it is a good shade but otherwise if someone from sugar is listening please please correct this in your lipstick it's super drying and it's not at all good but the color is fantastic i love it but like i generally love to mix this and this shade together now that was a very bright and striking red and this is a very good burgundy maroon crimson like thing It's the extreme matte long wear lip color in the shade 16 desired red. Definitely something desirable. I'll show it to you all. It's darker than the previous one. This I feel is a lipstick that is more elegant and it is not that striking out but it's a beautiful red which is dark in color suits very well for a night occasion I feel. My next lipstick is this one. It's again by Chamber and it's in the matte riot lipstick collection. It's the shade 283 Apricot Puddle and yeah the shade is a pink nude lipstick again. I have a lot of nude shades in my lipstick collection but I think that's wonderful because it sort of suits everyone and people are not afraid of trying the nude collections. Hmm. Like I used to apply this lipstick a lot when I bought it and um, after applying this I don't think it's the sixth lipstick that I like. I think it's more towards the bottom side. Uh, it's not a bad lipstick. It's a more peach pinkish lipstick and all these lipsticks I can use as a blush as well. So I like it like he Chambers Riot collection is like more on the affordable side. I think lips this lipstick was around 300 bucks or like less, I guess. And I think the other lipsticks are more on the expensive side, but this side of like Chambers really nice. Definitely something to check out. So do check them out. This lipstick ka packaging is so good it it feels like luxury in my hand. I got this with like a collaboration in November and I would not know about the brand but I tried it and it was really good. So this is super matte. Huh? I think this gives a very natural no makeup makeup look if you use this. I think you can use this as like a blush also and look very pretty. Kabhi kabhi mujhe lagta hai meri lipstick same hi lagti hai kya ek dusre ke sath. Thak gayi hu main lipstick laga laga ke. Now this lipstick I actually recently got to know that Mama Earth also has like a makeup collection apart from the skincare things. So um yeah I got this one and I really like this shade also because it's again a very natural pink and it's a crayon lipstick. I like crayon lipsticks. Easy to glide. Gives very girly vibes but honestly I really like it. Mujhe bolne mein itni difficulty ho rahi hai because mujhe ek ulcer ho gaya hai tongue pe. This is the last shade again very drying lipstick. Wish me luck. पता ही मतलब किस ब्रांड की होगी सो लॉर्ड ऑफ यूर माई थिंक दैट दिस एंड दिस लिपस्टिक इज वेरी सिमिलर बट टू बी वेरी ऑनेस्ट दिस वन इज मोर ऑरेंजिश एंड दिस वन इज मोर पिंकिश विद द अंडर टोन आई डोंट हैव दोज मजेंटा शेड इन दिस टॉप टेन बिकॉज दैट्स नॉट 
a color that I prefer wearing a lot. Ooh, I have this one really, really, really dark lipstick. I should make a shot on that. It's super dark. So, um, it was the first designer lipstick that I had, by the way. Okay, now, special mention lipstick time. This is the bonus lipstick that I wanted to show you all. So this lipstick, fun fact, I have like worn this lipstick for almost every video of mine in like early 2021s. 2022s, I used to put this and tap a little uh, talcum powder over it to make it like more matte. This was like my constant and uh, it was crayon in crayon and now it's in lipstick. Mein lag gaya. This is the second time I've purchased this lipstick and I like it. I loved it. Why did I replace it with the other lipsticks? Se is because this was very pink for me. It was a Barbie pink for me. I did not notice it's too pink until I got more nude pinker shades. Shit, I can feel that drying sensation in this lipstick as well. Is this a thing with all sugar lipsticks? Like, please comment and tell me if you've noticed it as well. And like, please pause the video and uh, if you have a sugar lipstick, hai, dry it. Let it be for like two minutes and tell me if it is super drying on your lips and it feels very chappy. So that was it for the video. I hope you like my collection. It was definitely more on the shades of nude, pinks and browns and um, reds. I don't, I'm not a magenta person. But um, if you would like to see more of that as well, it, that didn't make to my collection, the crimsons and the magentas and the dark pinks, then let me know. I'll make like a short video on that as well. <laughs> My favorite to you know, it's this. My favorite to you know, it's the Pillow Talk by Charlotte Tilbury lipstick and I love it. I, it is beautiful. But let me know about your favorite as well. And if you have any video requests, please let me know in the comment section. I will definitely make a video on that. See you next Saturday. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like the video. Share it, like it and it would mean the world to me if you support me in what I love doing. So thank you so much. Bye. I promise I'll be better with every video. So I'm just giving a try. So um, I hope you'll like it. <laughs>